Hello, this is Nairin from Nairin Sterile. Thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, please don't forget to like this video. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for and welcome. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. If you're not new, welcome back. Thank you for the support. Um, this will be a reading for Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising for the month of August. Uh, Please keep in mind, this is a general reading. You will not resonate with all. Take what does and leave the rest. If you want a personal reading, the information to book one is on my description box. You will visit my website, www.nagreentarot.com. Now, um, what we're gonna do here today, I'm gonna pull up cards from my Romans and your Oracle cards, and I will clarify them with the tarot the uh, Game of Thrones tarot cards. And then we're gonna hop over to Vimeo where I'm gonna look at the energy of the other person. I will look at their ener general energy, what they feel towards you, how they see you, what's in their mind, what are their intentions, what actions they're planning on taking, um, what, um, what actions they're planning on taking, what, I'm sorry, hold on, my kids are, Talking and I can't concentrate. I can't right now. Please. No. Hey. Yes. Could you please? Do we have little puppies in there as well? Oh. Please. Can Sorry I about that. Okay. So, on Vimeo, we're going to look at the, uh, uh, what is their intentions? what action they're planning on taking towards you, what is their blockages, what they're secretly holding from you, or what they want you to know, what is the possible outcome, and the uh, spirit's advice, okay? But let's get started here. So let's see what we have for Libra today. All right, thank you, we already got, ooh, romantic feelings, chemistry, healing family issues. One more card here. <clears throat> Flirts. Yeah. You're gonna get let your friends help you. You're gonna get two more and then an advice. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may not may differ from your usual type and expectation heart to heart conversations and then an advice here for Libras. All right, awesome. We got Libra here. Okay, yes. All right, so let's confirm these cards with the uh, Game of Thrones tarot cards here really quick. All right, let's see. Why is the romantic feelings card out here, please? For Libra, we got too many cards, so I'm gonna put them back. Why is the romantic um, feeling here for Libra, please? Romantic feelings, thank you. Why is the chemistry card out here for Libra, please? Chemistry card, why is it here? Thank you. Ooh, chemistry with an empress. Why is the healing family issues here for Libra, please? Why is the fam healing family issues card out here for Libra, please? Too many cards, oh, but we got one that flips, so I'll take this one. Why is the flirt card out here for Libra, please? Why is the flirt card out here for Libras? All right, thank you. Why is it let your friends help you out here for Libra, please? Let your friend help you. Thank you. Why is the keep an open mind card out here for Libras, please? Keep an open mind. Thank you. Why is the heart to heart conversations here? Why is the heart to heart conversations here? Thank you. 
Why is the passion card here? It's an advice for Libra. Why is the passion card? Thank you. Okay. All right, Libra. So here we go. At the end, at the end of the card, we got at the bottom of the deck. We have the Tower, followed by the Page of Cups, the Sun, the Moon, the Queen of Spears. So two, oh, two of Cups, and Justice in Reverse. So it could have been that something happened with a. Uh, Something ended, and now you want to bring an apology to this person. All right. So, Libra, what we have here. General energy, romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring, and they are clarified by the Seven of Swords. So somebody may have not been, um, may have been holding back from these feelings that they're, they're feeling. They don't, they don't want it to explore it and they were holding because they didn't kind of like trust it very much they were holding this uh source ready to pull it out when they need to they were holding something or something that they were keeping they were being secretly like they were holding something that they were not giving <coughs> they were hiding something they were hiding their feelings yeah i think that's what it is they were hiding their feelings and but they are uh, in their feelings then we have chemistry and then we have the empress this could be a Taurus, or it could be an aries so it doesn't have to be the empress is a very beautiful woman she's a leader mm, she could be a mother okay somebody that could be in the public eye very famous very popular could be maybe on a youtube channel popular in social medias and there is chemistry with this empress so there's a strong magnetic attraction here and you do feel that like she feels that like you both feel it like sex doesn't matter it could be female or male and you can switch this roles around as you please um on the what they see you for uh, healing family issues four of cups so somebody may have uh, rejected an offer and now they feel that this is a missed opportunity with somebody from their past somebody from their childhood or possibly their family but let's say here healing family issues somebody that they see as family this could be this empress here and now they're saying flirt and we have the five of cups in reverse and we have the nine of spears so somebody here wants to bring someone out of the cold they want to work with someone somebody else on the corner they want to flirt with this person but they feel that this person will be defensive okay so they're asking you that to let your friends help you because somebody walked away okay this could be that whoever missed this opportunity walked away and now you need your friends to help you with this because this other person will be very defensive whoever got rejected will probably be defensive or at least you fearing that this is what's going to happen because they wa and they walked away from you after this missed opportunity of that you rejected this or vice versa so now they're asking to let your friends help you now they do say keep an open mind because this is something that you manifested so it's probably that you rejected this opportunity but this is below this one you probably rejected this opportunity it says healing family issues so you probably rejected this opportunity because this is either somebody from your past it could be a friend and you kind of like wasn't expecting to have feelings for this friend so that they feel the friends have feelings for you that's why they're telling you right now that there is chemistry and the uh to go ahead and flirt because the romantic feelings are real okay but and this is something that you manifested so you probably manifested this and didn't even know it like maybe when you were thinking oh my goodness why can i have a person you probably thought why can't I have a person like this person or you kept saying what you wanted and this person had everything that you wanted which is probably why she was or he was your friends and I'm saying this because it's on uh, the family you should keep an open mind and you need to have heart-to-heart -heart conversations because right now you're actually in your head about this you're actually feeling defensive you have you guarded actually you're feeling guarded so you need to open your heart to this person you need to express how you feel uh, there's so uh, you hide, hiding your romantic feelings and the spirit of light is passion and then this is confirmed by heartbreak so whoever um, Rejected this other person it caused a heartbreak this person is very heartbroken by this This is probably why either you or the other person feel that now this person will be very Defensive and you may need your friends because this person walked away from you. 
okay so that's what i have for you i hope you like it i will continue this on vimeo we're going to look at the energy from the other person the general energy what they're feeling towards you what how they see you what's in their head um we're going to look at what intentions they have with you what actions they're planning on taking what is blocking them um what do they secretly want to tell you what is the possible outcome and i always say possible because the cards will pull up the energy that they're entertaining but that doesn't mean that they're going to follow through that energy or they're going to act on it so i always say possible and then we're also going to look at the spirits advice for you okay so i'll see you on the other end the link is on the description box also if you want a personal reading all that information is down there don't forget to like this video please and i love you lots of light positive energy and good things go your way. Bye-bye.